Hey guys, welcome back. Today we will discuss about other psychiatry topic that is postpartum blues. In the last video, we had a discussion regarding postpartum depression and postpartum problems. So here we will see what is postpartum blue. There is always a doubt that what is postpartum blue and what is postpartum depression? Is there any relationship between these two things or these two things are same? So we will discuss that thing in this video. Pregnancy and giving birth to a life is an exciting thing, right? In every human life and it is normal to feel emotional highs and lows during this time. Definitely emotional imbalance, sometimes highs, sometimes lows, that is quite natural in this time. After giving birth, some mother will feel very tired and showing a mood down stage after the birth. And this situation is known as postpartum blue so feeling tired feeling down feeling disturbances in some mood and it will occur after two to two to three days of the baby birth and this stage is known as postpartum blues so this baby blues usually go away by themselves so it is an absolutely normal thing it will go away within a week or two weeks and this situation is not a disease but note the point that if your sad feeling lasts longer than two weeks a medical advice is needed and if it is not treated in the proper way you will go to a stage of postpartum depression so what is the reasons or causes behind this postpartum blues or how the postpartum blues will turn to postpartum depression so what is the cause means hormonal changes hormonal changes are quite a natural process or normal process during the time of pregnancy and after the birth of child after the delivery estrogen and progesterone level will suddenly decrease and it can create mood swings so that is the first reason be behind this baby blues next thing is sometimes for some ladies thyroid hormone may drop sharply and this can create depression and tiredness and followed by that they will feel insomnia lack of appetite etc etc next cause is emotional issue emotional issue means nervousness like how to take care of their baby how you will manage your life with a new baby how you will continue your life all these things will come to their mind they will uh, come to their brain and that can create some stuck or emotional disturbances in the brain and in the mind and that may lead to baby blues so these are the two common cause of hope this baby blues or postpartum blues sometime partner will also feel baby blues yes up to 10 percentage of the partners can have baby blues for three to six months and sometimes it will continue for one year after the baby birth. Male partners also have the baby blues because of testosterone hormone changes. Testosterone is the hormone which is present in the male and which is responsible for mood maintenance. So if the testosterone level is decreasing and the estrogen level is increasing means there are chances of mood swings, depression, and other hormones like cortisol, vasopressin, prolactin also increases during this time and that can create a stage of depression and more changes. So up to 10% of the partners can have baby blues for 3 to 6 months. Sometimes it will continue for 1 year. What are all the symptoms in this baby blues in the case of partners means want to be alone, angry, anxious, loss of interest in work, frustrated or sad level of mood, feeling hopelessness, helplessness, worthlessness, etc., overwhelmed stage, trouble in sleeping, etc. Then, what is the management for this baby blues? Simple remedies only there. There is no medication. There is nothing for this um, uh, baby blues management. So, we cannot say the treatment modalities like that. So we can say the managements. So, what are all the management means? Sleep as much as you can. Give relaxation to your body. Talk to your family and friends. Use the relaxation techniques which is available, which is easy to use. Take some time for yourself. 
use support group there are a lot of support group to support the pregnant as well as the mother so use all the support groups and get their support eat healthy food do regular exercise and avoid alcohol so these things if you follow definitely you can come out from this baby blues next thing when baby blues tend to postpartum depression postpartum depression is little complicated thing and need to be give more care and attention otherwise there are chances of lot of complications in their life baby blues are perfectly normal guys but if the symptoms of baby blues continuing after few weeks means after this week or two week you may be in the starting stage of postpartum depression so don't get confused baby blues are quite natural perfectly normal thing but the symptoms of baby blues like sadness tiredness feeling down okay these symptoms are continuing for more than one week and disturbing your life means you are in the starting stage of postpartum depression and the person will show the symptoms like hopelessness worthlessness and sadness not feeling satisfaction as a mother or as a father getting anxiety and panic attack like they'll feel that they are about to die they are going to die they don't uh, get proper oxygen like everything is get stuck they're stuck somewhere like a oh, panic attack will come anxiety will come something gonna come and kill them like that a feeling will come some dangerous things are happening in their life the kind of feeling will come and obsessive compulsive natures will arise like every day they will try to clean many times they will change their nappies and pads of the baby many times they will clean the baby and uh after cleaning also they will ask everyone the baby is looks good baby is sleeping they don't sleep to check whether the, the baby is sleeping or not to check that so kind of unusual things will show in their life so these are all the symptoms of postpartum depression and this stage is considered as postpartum depression so baby blues and entirely different from postpartum depression baby blues is a normal thing is perfectly normal thing in everyone's every mother's life after giving birth to their baby but postpartum depression means the baby blue symptoms are continuing and giving disturbance to the family giving disturbance to themselves giving disturbance to the life of baby means that stage is known as postpartum depression and if you're not treating postpartum depression definitely lot of severe complications and hazards will arise okay guys so this is about postpartum blues hope you understand thank you